Welcome to Mass with Bob. Today we're looking at just some constructions and uh, first of all we're going to look at uh, 30, 60 and 90 degrees. Okay, so let's get started. We'll grab a ruler. Okay, now the first thing I always do is just draw a line. Um, okay, here we have just a new line. And now we want to construct, say, 60 degrees. We normally would uh, do it at a point, so let's put a point on the line, say A. And we're now going to construct 60, uh, 30, and 90 at, say, a point A. Now, we can do this all in one diagram. Um, I might just do it individually. I'll just, okay, so first up, let's grab the uh, lovely compass here. You can see here. So the first thing you do is you move the compass um, over to your particular point A. You move your compass out. Now, this is to any radius. Okay, now I'll just change the color of the arcs. Uh, okay, so you can see here. So the first arc. Okay, here's the first arc, okay. You want a decent compass for this, okay. So, okay, this is the first arc, okay. Uh, you make it go you know, past 90 degrees, okay, because we need to construct 60. So we then move your compass across to where that arc, let's actually call that point here B. Okay, so let's actually now move our compass point to B. Okay, so we're moving our compass point to B. Now, I just flip my compass there. You can see here, I'm now going to create another arc. Okay, so let's actually create another arc. Here we are. Okay, so this new arc, uh, okay, let's call that point uh, C. Now, if I join A and C, I should have 60 degrees. Now, um, okay, so if I join A and C, I uh, should have 60 degrees. I'll just uh, um, have a quick look here. You can see here, uh, I'll just draw a line, uh, okay, through that particular point. Okay, and you can see here, it is 60 degrees. I mean, my ruler measures 60 degrees. I'm pretty lucky here. I've got a ruler that measures it. But let's actually grab a protractor, one of these gadgets, okay? Now, this you can see here is a protractor. We always put the, the vertex, if you like, of the angle right in the center here. And if you have a quick look, let's try and line this up properly. Uh, I'll try and get it so it's actually, okay, just about right there. Okay, so you can see that's a pretty accurate 60 degrees, okay? Um, why does it work? Well, obviously it works on an equilateral triangle idea. Okay, so 60 is fairly easy. Okay, so um, let's actually now do uh, 30. Okay, so I want to construct 30. Okay, well, I've got 60 already, and as we can imagine, that um, 30 uh, is actually half of 60. So um, when you want to construct 30, you will, will need to get 60 first. So I'll just do it on the same diagram, I think. Uh, this one's not too bad. Okay, so I now need to bisect this part here. Okay, I'll just show you. Okay, so I need to bisect this bit. Now, to bisect it, I can actually, uh, if you like, uh, change my compass radius if I wanted to, but I'm going to just leave my compass radius the same and uh, extend this arc here. So this arc here, you can see here, I'm just going to extend it across into here. I'm going to form a new point in a second, and we're going to call it D. Now, I need to make... Okay, I need to now move my compass to part point C. I'll, okay, now I'll just flip it around and I'll just show you. I need to make another uh, arc cutting, if you like, just here. Okay, now this is the new point, uh, the intersection of those two. That would be the new point D. Okay, now if I join A and D, I should actually have 30 degrees. So let's actually just see. Uh, that's not doing it. I need to get a little bit specific with this ruler. Okay, so about 30 degrees. I just actually set the compass, well, the ruler, sorry, to 30 degrees and just see how close we are. And if you have a quick look here, I'll draw it in another color. Uh, let's actually do it red. So if you have a look here, the ruler is measuring it at 30 degrees, but let's actually just get our protractor again. And uh, okay, let's move it across and just have a quick look. Okay. Okay, and you can see, uh, okay, it's not, oh, yeah, it's not too bad. Okay, so it's a pretty good bisection, if you like, of that angle 60 degrees to 30 degrees. Okay. So if you like, angle DAB is now 30, and angle CAB, you can see there, is 60. Okay, well, let's pause it for a minute and we'll have a look. We'll go back and construct 90, 90 from scratch. Okay, so the first thing you do, obviously, is you draw a line. Okay, that's 60. Draw a line. Okay. 
Okay, and we would have to construct it at some point, say, A. Okay, so let's actually construct 90 at A. Okay, we then need to get our compass. Uh, okay, all right, so now we open the compass at any radius. To any radius, we just move it across here to a compass point to A, and now we're going to draw a fairly big arc now. Okay, um, let's actually move it out, out a bit. Let's sort of draw a really big arc. Okay, here we go. Big arc. So we need a fairly big arc because I need to step two steps across. So, okay. All right. So let's mark this point here, B. Now I'm going to move my compass point to B. Okay, to B. Here we go. I'm going to flip it. Okay, uh, I'm going to need to make two arcs. So I now go one arc. Uh, that point there, let's call that C. Now I move my compass now to point C. Okay. I need to do another arc on this la rather large arc I originally drew. Okay, so here's a rather large one. Now, what I like to do usually is actually extend that arc right up to the top here. Okay, because I'm now, okay, I made a new point, let's call that point D. And I now move my compass to point D. And then I uh, just, uh, I call it back step, if you like, step back onto that original arc from that new point D. Okay, now, it does look reasonably sophisticated, so many arcs, but let's actually, we now, you know, say A, B, C, D, let's call this new point up here E. Okay, let's actually now try and draw a line from A to D. Okay, uh, okay so here we go, let's have a look. Uh, okay, well, my rule is saying 89 degrees. Um, I'll just, put, okay, let's put the line down here. You can see it's slightly off, so let's see if I can move that line a little bit. Uh, okay, that's a bit, okay, all right. So let's actually have a look. Okay, at, I mean, you can see, uh, okay, it's pretty, it uh, should be pretty spot on here. Okay, yeah. So you can see, yes, actually, uh, it's pretty much uh, spot on uh, 90 degrees. Okay. All right, well, uh, thank you for watching. We'll do some more construction shortly.